Start with lifting this left leg up, right leg straight. I want to exhale as you go down for a single leg good morning. You can outstretch those arms, really think about getting all that hamstring work going on here. Exhaling, back up to stand. Okay, so staying with this leg here, trying to extend those arms, keep that gaze down as you exhale, back up to standing. I can really feel this already on my right glutes, back of my right leg, keep that gaze down at the mat, head and chest nice and long, exhaling back. Woo! So all the time we're keeping this left leg raised, Good. gazing at the mat, exhaling, back up, and last one, going down, exhaling really slowly, so a lot of balance work going on today, so this time I'm going to raise that right leg, and again we're going to come down. Keep that gaze at the floor, trying to keep that back nice and straight, that gaze down. As you exhale, back up. Good, stay with it. Keeping that right leg just hovering above the ground. Big exhale. Back to standing. Good. I'm talking really quietly because I feel like I don't want to disturb Eric, like my new baby. Good. If you didn't know, it isn't actually a baby, it's a puppy. I'm not sure if you can see. He's basically lying on it. The girl's, oh, I've put my foot down. He's lying on the girl's cuddly onesies at the back behind me. We'll see how we go. He might do a little wander around in a minute. Good, and last one. Whoa, you should really be feeling this on that left leg. Because I am. Good. Okay, so coming to the back of your mat. Again, I want you to lift that right leg up. So we're going to hinge down. So when you hinge, think about keeping this back nice and straight. Almost like you're going to push that bum up behind you. Hands on the hips. So get right low as you can. Walk forward into a plank and keep this right leg lifted. And do a little up and down for two and three, bend that left leg, stay low, hands on hips, as you come up to stand, good, so stay with this side, so we're coming down, walking out, hands underneath those shoulders, right leg straight, as you one, two, three, bend that left leg, hands on hips, up to stand, we've got three more, so hinging at the hips, walking out with those hands into that plank, right leg straight as you one, two, three, walking back, staying low, up to stand. Again, we've got two more. Big deep hinge, walking forward, hands below those shoulders, one, two, three, coming back. Hands on hips. Last one, I think. Good. Walking forward into that one legged plank. One, two, three. Coming back, holding it here. Just extend that right leg behind you. You can't see me. There, okay? And just stay with this side. For this left leg, should be really burning. Good, try and keep all that weight in that left heel as you raise and lower this leg. Four, eight, seven, six, five. Whoa, keep your gaze down for balance. Four, three, two, one. Whoa, how are you doing? It's tough today, but I love balancing, okay? So taking this left leg off the ground. Hinging, whoop, it's difficult when I look at the camera. Good, planting those hands down. 
walking forward, three, two, one, coming back, hands on hips, push to stand, good, and again, walking forward, one, two, three, coming back, push to stand, good, we've got three more, coming forward, one, two, three, hands on hips, up to stand, two more, good, Whoa, I'm really out of breath, three, two, one, coming back, hands on those hips, up to stand, last one, good, coming forward, holding it here for three, for two, one, coming back, I'll just stoop forward, okay, so I'm going to be here, and stay low, as you lift that leg, up and down, keep your day, your chin, your neck nice and long here, all the way in the back of that right leg, you can go a bit lower if you like, ouch, four, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one, Whoa. good, okay, staying with this balancing theme, I want you to lift that right leg up, so balancing on that left leg, so we're going to do, I'm just going to check you can see me, okay, so I'm gazing at the ground, I'm balancing on this leg, arms forward, we can keep your hands here if it's, if you need to, trying to keep those hips both facing down, extend that arm, extend that leg, good, hands on the hips, coming up, can you take that right leg forward and just hold it here, good, pulling in through here, lifting that leg a little bit higher, and again, just coming back through, extend that leg, hips facing down towards the mat if you can for an extra challenge, extend those arms, hands back to those hips, as you come back up nice and slowly to stand, raise that right leg, good, shoulders down, a little bit higher, a little bit higher, taking it back into that warrior three pose, if you want you can keep the hands on the hips, or if not extend those arms, good, a little soft knee in that, balance, that left balancing leg, so you're not over hyperextending that left knee, holding it here, good again, watch those shoulders haven't come up by your ears like mine just did, good, how are we doing, coming forwards, extending those arms, good, ouch, my left leg is on fire, good, Whoa. little wobble, good, again shoulders, holding it here, can it go a little bit higher, a little bit higher, good, coming back, last one, extend those arms, keep those both of those hips facing the mat, hands back on the hips, as we come back up, final little leg raise, Whoa. watch the balance, holding it here for three, two, one, good, swapping sides, lifting that leg to left leg up, taking it in to this warrior three pose, neck nice and long again, hips facing down, a soft knee with this right leg, can we extend those arms, good, hands back on the hips, coming up, shoulders down, away from that, like this, which I always seem to be when I'm in this position, good, coming back forward, hips facing the ground, neck nice and long, extend those arms, good, Ooh, wobble, wobble, so much concentration, which is really good, just to take your mind out of your everyday, for 30 minutes, just really focusing on this little routine, how to stay balanced, good, extending those arms, 
Nice. Also, you get really out of breath just holding in poses. This is my cardio for today. Good. Lifting that leg up a little bit higher. Should we do two more? Coming forwards. Extend those arms for an extra challenge. Hips facing down. A soft knee in that standing leg so you're not hyperextending. Hands on the hips. Whoa. Balance. Come forward, holding it here. Good. And last way. Coming down. Whoa. Extending those arms. Good. Hands on the hips. Coming back up. Last little leg raise for three, for two, and one. I'm still talking quietly so as not to disturb the puppy. I'm sure this will all change, but he's only, we've only had him for two days. Okay, so left leg on the floor. Now what you need to do, so we're thinking about the tree pose here in yoga, but for extra challenge, just hover that foot away from that left thigh. Okay, so then it takes it all into here, your core to keep it active, to keep that heel lifted, keep those hips facing me here, good, holding it there, keep that cheek, kind of trying to think about that knee, kind of coming behind you, it's really tricky to stay in this position, holding it, you can take the arms up if you like, good, for five, for four, shaking, three, two, and one, good, that's such a burner, good, and then you can do that again, so bringing that foot up with a little help from your hand if you need, and then should we just see what happens when you just take that foot away a little bit, good, trying to keep those hips facing me, so everything is working super hard here, this is like on fire, my hips, my core, good, my standing leg holding me in position. Should we do some funky arms here? We could do a little kind of yogi vibe going on, holding it here for four. That's one talking nice and softly spoken. Three, two, and one. Good. Okay, so now we're going to come into our little warrior two position. Okay, so trying to get as low as you can. Have this heel directly under your knee, okay? This left foot facing forward, arms out to the side, shoulders nice and low. Good, and just kind of get comfy in this position. Okay, so what we're gonna do is, I'm hoping I can stay on camera here. My camera skills are terrible. So basically I'm gonna come up to a little balance. So you can use a chair here for support if you need. So I'm in this half moon position, which no one can see, hang on, there, good. So again, hold on to something for balance if you need, that's fine, no problem, good. And then now we're going to bring it back to that warrior two, and just a little reverse warrior, keeping that right knee nice and nice and bent. Okay, we're going to go back into that. So. Wah, wah, wah. Holding on if you need in this half moon. This is what I did. Whoop. Okay, hang on. I did a lot of this when I was pregnant. A lot of balancing. It seemed to really help. So maybe that's just me being weird. Good. Okay, I'm once more pushing off that back foot. Feel free to hold a chair, block here. Good. Trying to come just lifting up that waist a bit. Facing me if you can for an extra challenge. That balancing leg is doing loads of work. Good, and gently lowering that back foot for a little reverse. Real big bend of that right knee. We'll do two more times, okay? So coming up. Concentrating. Good. Can I look at the camera? <laughs> Just about. Good. Quiet little land of the foot back into this reverse warrior. Okay, last time. 
coming forward. Whoa, okay, completely lost it then. Wow, and that's the good thing about balance. Every day is different. Every side is different. Doesn't matter, who cares? Just go with it. You can spend too much time worrying about everything in life. You really don't need to worry about postures or positions. Just do whatever feels good sometimes. That's my advice. Okay, swapping sides. Right, are we ready for this? So kind of really push off that back toe. So you're almost hovering in the air for a minute. Good. And then really gently landing back in that reverse warrior position. Good. Again, pushing off that right leg. Floating in midair. Hold a wall, a bench, a chair, a block, anything if you need. Good. Bend, landing quietly. Really nice. Stretch back. Let's do it again. We're coming up. Ooh. Good. Loads of work just to strengthen the feet, the ankles when you're doing lots of balancing. Good. Landing quietly. Reversing. I think we've got one more. Okay, let's go. Pushing off that right foot into that, what's it called, half moon, holding it here, good, and then the last, reverse warrior, back, Whoa. nice, okay, how are we doing, that was a challenge, but really good, who cares if you fall around and fall on the floor, it literally makes no difference, okay, so now we're going to do a curtsy, so left leg forward, taking that right leg, so all the weight is in my right, um, foot now to really bring on that right glute. So I'm going to just go as low as I can. Whoop, and then I'm just going to little kick out. Okay, so coming back, balancing, kick. Good. So stay really upright in that torso as you take that right leg back. Again, really slow, controlled, purposeful movements. Making every little bit count. Good. Keep going. Five more. Woo! I'm shaking. Right. And again, feel free to hold a chair. Any support you need. Good. Taking that weight back. And up and kick. Two more. And kick, good. And last one, nice. Okay, swapping sides, left leg back. Torso nice and upright. Taking that left knee back, whoop. Little kick, good. Let's do this. Whoa. Kicking out, taking that leg back. Really pushing off that left toe as you come back to stand. Good, five more. Remember if you have music at home, put some music on to make this seem a bit more fun. In the real life, in person, we'd have my little playlist on. Whoa. And we'd be laughing, good. And probably falling over lots. Last one. Nice. I'm just going to have some water. Okay, so we're coming down to our mats now. So you can kind of pad your knees out a bit here. So we're going to do this little thigh stretch. So tuck that pelvis under, extending back. Then I want you to lift that right leg. Keep that left leg off. Whoop. As you come up onto the toe. Okay, so bring that left leg down. Little thigh stretch. I'm gonna carry on with this right leg forward. Right leg forward, standing up into a little walk. A little heel raise. Good. Right leg up. Up to stand, onto the toe, left leg back. 
thigh stretch. Really tuck that pelvis under. Bring that right leg forward. Up to stand. Good, should we do three more? You can go a little bit further back each time, if you can. Good. Whoa. This one's a killer. Good, onto those toes. So now we're gonna swap sides, bring this left leg up. Onto our toes, right leg down, left leg, little thigh stretch. Again, up with this left, onto the toes, right leg down, a thigh stretch. Tuck that pelvis under. Good, coming back up. Little toes, bring that right leg down. Good, keep going. Up onto those toes, whoop. Thigh stretch. Good. Up onto the toes. Last one. Coming up. Good. Okay, so now we're going to put our mat back. So now we're getting really juicy into the legs here. So balancing on that left leg. I want you to come down to this hinge here, stay low, take that right leg back nice and straight, take it out to the side, take it back up to stand, okay? So we're going to hinge here, right leg straight out, right leg over to the side, right leg back, Whoa. up to stand, okay? So we're going to hinge, extend that right leg, keep it raised off the floor, taking it over to the right, back behind you, wobble, up to stand again. If you need balance or support, cool, go for it, out to the right, good, back up to stand, little squat, extend that right leg. Out to the side, oh my gosh, I'm burning. Good. Back up to stand. A little hinge. Extend that right leg. Out to the side. And back. Whoa, up to stand. One more. Hinging. Extend. Across. Duh. And ouch. Okay. Good, so we've got this. So lifting this leg up. Left leg raises, extending it out, out to the side, and back, and up. So you can make this more challenging if you want to go even lower. Good, send that leg out, out to the side, back, and up. Hinge, extend, out to the side, oh my god I'm so out of breath. Good, back up, hinge, extend, how are we doing, this is tough, I'm sorry, good, extend, whoa, good, back up to stand, I think it's two more, I've lost count to be honest, let's just go with it, good, back up, Last time, extend, out to the side, and back up to stand. Ooh. Okay, we've got two more moves and then you're done. Right, so sitting down, fingertips facing towards you. Lifting this, so roll those shoulders back. Lift that bum up, extend that right leg. I want you just to exhale. Inhale. Push through those arms. Push. Really rounding. Trying to get that knee all the way to your nose. 
pushing through those arms. Really lift that left hip up. Good, three more. Two more. Last one. Let's stay lifted. Left leg. Extend. 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 Ah, so tricky. I'm literally shaking. Three more. And last one. Oh my goodness. Okay. So, almost there, last one. Roll those shoulders back behind you. Holding on underneath your backs of your knees. Exhale. We need to really curve, hollow out that core, chin to chest. Trying to almost drop that back of that pelvis to the mat. Pulling up through your pelvic floor, your belly button. Holding it here, lift that right foot to tabletop. Left foot to tabletop. If you want, arms raised. Hands back down, right foot down. Inhaling to seating, so we can do that again. So we exhale, left leg, right leg. Stay in that scooped out, that capital C position. If you want an extra challenge, lift those arms up. Hands back behind the knees, left, right. Woo. Exhaling, right leg up to tabletop. Keep that curve in the spine. Can we lift those hands? Up to the sky, Woo. <laughs> right leg down, left leg, inhaling, so exhaling, left leg, right leg, little leg, I couldn't take my arms too high, that was just too much, left leg down, right leg, inhaling, let's keep going, Roar. okay, I'm shaking everywhere, right leg, left leg, inhale, left leg, right leg, left leg, right leg, inhale, should we do one more each way, tabletop, you can stay here, that's still really challenging, or just a little hover of those hands, stay scooped out, right leg, left leg, Inhale, last one. Okay. Whoa. Shaking, shaking, shaking for three, for two, for one. Good. And you're done. Okay. Oh, Alexa, stop. Oh my God. That timing was impeccable. Okay, if you wanted a little, weedy little stretch, have your hands behind you. Left leg, left foot on right knee. Just walk those hands towards you for an extra little glute stretch. Rolling those shoulders away from you. Good, I hope you enjoyed that. That was quite challenging, wasn't it? But quite different. I quite like to just mix it up all the time because it's pretty boring otherwise. And it's good to keep challenging yourselves. Um, yeah, if there's anything that anyone really, I've just swapped knees. If there's anything that anyone really wants to try or do, let me know. Um, basically, I love all forms of exercise. I don't think you need any equipment. You can just use your own body and, um, yeah, and exercise in a challenging but yet really effective way. Good. And mix it up with a walk in the fresh air or with a run. I like to just do 30 minutes inside of, well, outdoors preferably, of kind of focused, toning, sculpting moves, and then just go for a walk or go for a run. That's it. Bosh. Done. And eat well. Eat loads, but the rainbow. Just cook everything from scratch. Okay, that's my last little um, bit of advice for today. Feet down. Let's just finish with a little happy baby. So relax that tummy. Relax that pelvic floor. Pull those feet. You can kind of pull, push and pull, so you can push into the hands and push into the feet, so you're like tugging with the hands and pushing with the feet. Trying to keep that lower back, massaging on the floor, shoulders away from your ears, and then just hang out here. 
for the afternoon, maybe. <laughs> maybe just a few more breaths. For four. Really concentrate on relaxing that tummy. So basically, I just always hold my tummy in too much and my latest challenge is just trying to let go. Just reduce some of the tension in my abdomen. So this is a really good position and also just to release that pelvic floor a bit, which quite often they can be too tight as well. Good. And you're done. Um, let me know if you enjoyed that and any feedback and have a great rest of your day. Um, you didn't get to meet Eric because he's just... Hang on, let's see if we can just go over to Eric. Eric, Eric. Eric, I've got really bad hand to eye. What's